Hispanic population continues to grow in Austin each year. And one of the challenges local schools are facing, getting Spanish-speaking parents involved in their kids' education. And this year's NBC Education Nation Summit in New York City is highlighting, highlighting a program experiencing a lot of success. And KXAN's education reporter Aaron Cargiles there and is live in New York this morning. Good morning to you, Aaron. Yeah, good morning, Sally and Robert. That program is actually working in Chicago and has been for 16 years. It is one of 10 case studies that NBC will focus on at this year's summit. Now, uh, it is a parent mentor program put together by a neighborhood association. They are mostly Latino immigrant women and some African-American parents who work side by side with teachers and one on one with struggling students tutoring them. Now, schools who partner with this group have experienced better test scores and happier students and families. It has strengthened parent-teacher relationships as well. Now we will have much more on this program tonight on KXAN News at 6. Also an interview with San Antonio Mayor Julian Castro, who is here in New York City right now and will be attending Education Nation today. Robert and Sally. Now Aaron, this is day two of this big summit uh, that NBC is sponsoring. You've got a busy day today, right? Yeah, it's a very big day today. Of course, there was a teacher town hall yesterday, but a lot of these panels kick off today. Of course, starting at about 9 o'clock this morning. Of course, 9 o'clock New York time, of course. But a lot of these case studies will be dissected, and there are people on these panels. The San Antonio mayor is going to be on a panel. A uh, University of Texas student with the UTeach program is going to be on a panel later today. We're going to actually be hearing from him in the next half hour. Aaron, thanks for that. Live in New York City this morning and again, checking in with Aaron in about 30 minutes here. Fascinating things going on in the world of education in New York.